Hi guys, let's create one project that has a multiple table view and a single view controller. Take one single view application and name it like multi table. Here, table view. For each table view, we'll give a prototype cell. Let's add this. One prototype cell. Okay, so now we'll select the basic style and give identifier one and for this we'll do same and we'll name it like two Let's connect connect it to view controller with data source and data delegate Create one file that has a view, the table view reference, table view cell reference. Table view cell five. <clears throat> you like it? Class. Now we will allocate the class for each table view cell. This is for one. This is for two. Yeah, we have given so now reference uh, one. For second table view, reference two. Okay. Now come to the view controller. Take UI data source and UI table view delegate. Oh no, <laughs> not in this view controller. Table view data source. So
take these two methods. So we will overwrite this method. Do error. Uh, one four. Fruits. Second array for second table view that has flowers. Now we'll write condition like uh, if table view is. First of all, we'll take output outlet for this table view. Where is my another class you can do yeah. First table and Second table go to the main if table view is a first table Return at one dot count. Else return at a two count. Same condition for display cells in table let's where cell table view identify yeah, this one cell one here will be index path as our pre made table view cell one class here. So it cell will get the ref reference of label will text array one index path row return cell that's good copy for this we will come here cell 2 and change it table cell, table view cell 2 array 2 here will comes to because we give we gave a reference cell as an reference cell to 
then that now everything looks good so let's run it Ooh. Here's the first label, first table view. Here's the second table view. That's it, guys. Thanks for watching.